it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw Spider-Man versus Venom. It's like a face-off shot, so it's going to be like one face and the other. There's also going to be a little bit, this will speak some color here as well. So absolutely stay till the very end of the video. It should be only like a 10-minute video. Um, and that's it. It's for beginners, uh, so you should be able to do this step by step. Um, and that is all. Okay, let's get started, all right? first thing we're gonna do oh one thing before i do that don't forget if you like learning how to draw marvel characters hit the subscribe and click the bell notification so let's get started here i'm gonna go over here and i'm gonna draw spider-man's head first um and i'm what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna start with the curve uh, so as you can tell my paper's uh landscape and what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna go over here start with a brow like the front of his face then i'm gonna pull up a line up here for the forehead. I'm gonna go over here, pull out here for kind of the nose area of Spider Man. And then I'm gonna pull down here for the front of the face. So from the forehead, I'm gonna go, it's gonna roll up to the top of the head over here. And I'm gonna start curving that line back for the back of the skull. right and it's gonna pull down into the neck and then it's gonna pull back into the rest of the trapezius I'm gonna go here to the front pulling up here for the back like the jaw pulling up here I'm gonna go here the neck may on this area I'm gonna pull a line down for the throat then down for the neck and then maybe right here for the chest area so that's Spider-Man as far as like the placement on the paper. And I want to put Venom over here, maybe even closer to him. You know, maybe he's taking up more of the space of the paper. Um, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to throw line here for the top of Venom's like mouth area. Line up here for the eye. Curve for the forehead. And then it's going to pull back along here for the back of the skull pull down line out here for the back of the neck so there's gonna be teeth here at the front and I guess that's kinda of what I'm gonna do for now I'm gonna draw the lip area line down here for the open mouth I want it to be like in his face kinda of thing and I'm, it's gonna pull right here for the side of the mouth pull down curve underneath here and this is all like the lip down underneath here and then we're going to find the jaw and so it's going to have open up really wide pulling up here for the back of the jaw here down I'm going to draw a line over here underneath for the throat downward here his neck is way bigger because he's a way bigger dude uh, line over here and then down for his chest over here okay so let's draw the tongue and I'm gonna draw a line out here get some space here well, actually I'm gonna go over here I'm gonna go over here have it right in his face right in his eye pull it back over here line so we have his tongue Okay, gonna go in and draw those teeth. That's easy for me, at least. We're drawing these different sized triangles aiming downward. Gonna go over here to the lip. So I'm gonna pull this, it's gonna curve out here. And I'm gonna throw a line up like in this smiley fashion. The reason is this is the skin on the side of the mouth when he opens it up. When, like when dinosaurs or lizards currently, when they open their mouth, it has a little bit of a skin flap on the sides when they open it up. And that's kind of what Venom has and it looks really cool. Gonna pull down here, curve in there. Gonna go to the back over here and I'm gonna draw that spiky pattern in the back a little bit. Just this time it's gonna be solid and I'm going to pull down here for the far side and I'm going to fill that in. So that's going to be a dark um, 
it's going to be pretty much dark all, all the whole thing there. So, I'm going to find the teeth below. Try to vary them up because real animals have various sizes of teeth. You know, varied up at least a little. Pull down. Going to go do the same thing. Find the back row over here and it's going to go up. So, I'm going to fill that back row in. Line over here. Line over here. Let's go into the eyes of these two people, these two guys here. Uh, Eddie and Spider-Man, or I mean, um, Peter Parker, right, obviously. Um, maybe draw some holes in, the, in the, that side. That would be cool. But let's draw the eyeball. The eye, I mean, eyeball. Line over here on the inside. Pulling up. And it's going to be a little wavy go straight over here and it's gonna be I, I want mostly the curve the the curvy weird these designs right here are just more or less made up on my part but the bottom I think is straight not always of course it's different versions line over here from the throat here and there's a lot of you know lines just all over the place um, because he is a monster and he's his throat's going nuts, right? He's like really intense. That's a big part of Venom. He's super, super uh, intense guy. Not as intense as Carnage, but he's pretty intense in the comic. I don't know why they made him a good guy in the movie. That's bizarre. Let's go over here to um, Spider-Man now. Let's go find him. And we're going to go over here. Curve. Line up down over here and that's going to pull back up as well find the webbing right here on his outfit which should be relatively simple it's like a little explosion pattern in the center at least just center very very like zigzaggy and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw the lines and when we draw the lines here i'm gonna think about how they roll around the head i'm thinking about the head in in 3d and how that's that's affecting it Like so, I'm thinking about how that would roll off. And then in between these, I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna draw those warped lines right here for the web, right? And it, there's a, there's not a lot of rules for the web as long as they connect to each other. And um, you can kind of always, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be placed exactly any certain way. So you can, there's a lot of leeway with the webbing of the outfit here right there's no certain number and uh that you know that it's just really cool so that's it that's it for the face off i am going to color it now um stick around for that that's going to be sped up though because um i don't want you to just sit here watching me do this because i made videos like that and everybody's like that's too slow so i am going to color it stick around for that i'm going to speed it up and contain it in like 30 seconds or something um and that's pretty much it if you enjoyed the video please hit that like and hit the subscribe okay i'm sorry subscribe yeah that too but share share with a friend that you think might enjoy it um there's just this everybody here i have like the best um i don't know followers i don't like saying fans i find that very strange to say but i have like the best followers on this channel everybody's been so massively nice um but yeah i post three times a day every weekday thank you so much i will see you next time stick around for the color let us start that